I pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Cardinals. Hope you're all doing well today. I'm Santi. And I'm Mati. Let's begin your daily announcements. If you're a student in need of any items, visit the new Cardinal Nest. The Cardinal Nest is located in room 1154. This is a confidential and welcoming place for students to get what they need. That includes food items for school or at home, clothing such as winter coats, hats, and gloves, personal hygiene items, school supplies, and items by special request. All of these items are available at no cost. The nest is open Monday through Friday from 11 a.m. until 1 p.m. or at any time accompanied by an MHS staff member. Visit mhscardinalnest.org for more information. Middleton High School is partnering with Doorways to College Foundation to offer, offer an ACT prep course for students. ZAPS ACT prep is a five hour seminar where students will learn test taking techniques intended to improve ACT scores, help reduce test anxiety and build students confidence. This will be held on January 31st and February 1st from 4 to 6.30 p.m. The program cost is $100. You can register for this program by visiting doorwaytocollege.org. Don't forget that National Honor Society applications are open now. ASR1 will be open for questions and help on the application today, Monday the 31st. Membership applications are due February 4th, 2022 at 4 p.m. Another reminder that eSports Club is holding an information meeting today after school in room 2809 at 4 p.m. If you're interested in competing against other high schools across the country in Smash Bros, Overwatch, Rocket League, or League of Legends, please attend or reach out to Mr. Brousseau or Mr. Perez. Seniors, be sure you check out the MHS website to find scholarship opportunities. Our website lists tons of local and general scholarships offered. So make a plan to visit the site when thinking about your post high school plans. Navigate to the menu on the homepage, then find the student service section and click on the post high school planning where you'll find the general scholarship opportunities link. Have questions about your course selections for next year? See your counselor during, during ASR in the LMC classroom. Oh, there's an LMC classroom? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, They'll be there to help out today, next Monday and next Wednesday. Students, please put on your radar that the Early College Credit Program summer applications are due on February 1st. You can get an application online or from your counselor. Submit them to your counselor by February 1st. It's time for open gyms for many sports. Here are some updates. Starting with Baseball Open Gym Sunday from 4 to 6 p.m. at the Fieldhouse. Tuesdays from 4 to 5.30 p.m. at the Indoor Facility. And Fridays from 7 to 8.15 a.m. at the Fieldhouse. Girls Across Open Gyms are on Sundays from 1 to 3 p.m. on February 6th, 20th, and 27th. Anyone interested in lacrosse is invited. Boys Lacrosse Open Gyms take place every Tuesday and Thursday through February 24th at the Sock Trail Elementary Gym from 8.15 to 10 p.m. Softball Open Gyms take place Sundays from 6 to 8 p.m. at the Field House, Tuesdays from 6.30 to 8 a.m. in the Field House, and Thursdays from 4 to 5.30 at the Indoor Facility. Hey, sophomores and juniors, the opportunity to make a huge difference at MHS by applying to be a link leader for the, uh, for the 2022 to 23 school year is now open. 
To apply, simply scan the QR code on your screen and head to the Link Crew webpage under Student Organizations and Student Leadership tabs on the MHS website. Applications are due on Friday, February 25th, no later than 4 p.m. Email Mr. Jurasevich with any questions. Homework Club meets today. Get help with your math, science, social studies, English, or world language classwork. Homework Club meets from 4 to 5 p.m. at the Phoenix Commons at the top of the social stairs. Drop by the LMC tomorrow for Make Your Space Day. They are, ma they are making shrinky dinks. Media Club's first meeting is on Monday, January 31st at 4 p.m. This club will give students the opportunity to be creative and create content. No previous experience is necessary to join. The club will teach you the tools on how to use both the equipment and programs. We'll meet in the video recording studio, which is room 2206. Make sure you bring some fresh ideas and we can't wait to see you there. Contact Mr. Cole with any questions. Join Media Club, it's worth it. Don't forget to stop by Amnesty International's Club's Pins and Stickers fundraiser today and tomorrow. Please stay tuned for more announcements to follow. Bye. Bye. That's fun. <laughs> Hi, if you are a leader of an MHS student organization, please consider representing your clubs with the Middleton High School Leadership Council. I'm Erin, the president of Key Club and Relay for Life. And I'm Daphne, the president of Green Team, FBLA, and DECA. We are both senior representatives on the Leadership Council. As a part of the council, we work with Mr. White to approve and reject club applications and organize fundraising. If you are interested in joining us, please apply at the link below. If you have any questions, please email Mr. White at... Thank you. Thank you. This weekend is Relay for Life's annual Coaches vs. Cancer Games. Come and support your boys and girls varsity basketball teams who are also making a difference in the fight against cancer. There will be a minute of fundraising during both half times and shirts, stickers, pins, and more for sale outside of the gym. And proceeds will be used to cover expenses for this year's Relay for Life event in April. And leftover funds will be donated to the American Cancer Society. The girls game is at 7.15 this Friday and the boys game is at 7.15 this Saturday and both are against Memorial at home. We would love to see you there helping us cheer on our Cardinal basketball program while also honoring Middleton community members, staff, and loved ones who have battled and are battling cancer. Thank you! Are you a high school student interested in becoming an educator? Good news! You can now cut down on the cost and time of your four-year bachelor's degree, even for those who thought a bachelor's degree was out of reach for them. Thanks to Madison College's Education Academy, students in their junior or senior year of high school can enroll in dual credit courses. You can complete up to two semesters towards your associate's degree while you're still in high school, and it won't cost you a dime. While students are in our academy, they will meet with their high school counselors and Madison College academic and faculty advisors. Staff will support students in choosing courses, assist them if they feel they are struggling, and offer resources which will help them in their studies. This will set you up to transfer to your four-year university in no time. Our goal is to help students discover the joy of teaching through education courses and field experience. Also, if you find out education is not your thing, no worries, you can change your mind at any time. While there's no GPA requirement for the Education Academy, all students will need to meet the course requirements to participate. If you are interested in becoming an educator and to get out teaching as fast as possible, contact your guidance counselor for an application. Or reach out to our early college team for more information about the Education Academy at Madison College.